All right. And of course, we know the Tigers will be in Cincinnati tomorrow evening. And it looks like at least the weather will cooperate. It'll be warm, but it'll be dry. And it looks like we're going to be facing the same type of atmosphere, the same type of weather as we go into the weekend. Today, there is a chance for an isolated shower in a couple spots. Not a huge deal. It'll be less humid today than yesterday and then even drier feel to the air tomorrow. But we're bringing back the heat and the humidity for the upcoming weekend. Looking at the radar right now, and you can see those clouds just sort of forming. It's a mix of sun and clouds out there right now. Not tracking any rain on the radar at this time. But again, an isolated shower possible when we really start to heat up. We call it peak heating of the day up until about 6 o'clock. 80 degrees in Redford already. You're at 80 in Novi and Metro. Airport is at 80, Wyandotte as well, 81 degrees in Warren. So the temperatures are pretty comfortable, 78 in Lake Orion, Romeo, 77, St. Clair. Temperatures today in the low 80s for highs, so some of us are almost there already. As far as the humidity, steady for the afternoon. Again, a little better, better feel than yesterday. It'll start to decrease late tonight and then pretty manageable for your Friday. More 70s off to the north, so high temperatures projected in the mid-70s around Traverse City, Alpena, upper 70s in Grand Rapids, so we're kind of settling into that relatively cooler air mass considering where we've been. And then we're starting to see some of those 90s from Omaha, Kansas City to St. Louis, so it'll take some time, but it looks like it's back in here for the weekend. So we look at our hour-by-hour -hour forecast, and there is a cold front drape just off to our south, so again, triggering an isolated shower, certainly possible this afternoon, but high pressure will build in from the north. And as it does, it'll cut down on any of that moisture and will dry out overnight. Speaking of tonight, time is running out to view the comet Neowise if you want to about 10 p.m. to 2.30 in the morning. Best bet is just to look to the northwest. Look for the Big Dipper. The bottom left corner of the Big Dipper's bowl is what you can find. Binoculars certainly would help, though, as it starts to get a little bit dimmer. So today, temperatures in the low 80s, and then tonight will drop down to 65 degrees. It's going to be comfortable tonight under a partly cloudy sky. Near 90 on Saturday, more humidity this weekend. And then late Sunday, our next chance for showers and storms into Monday. So there is going to be some heat back on for the weekend. Stay with us. We have more 7 Action News ahead.